Oh, hey, what are you doing down there? You're supposed to be in Senpai HQ with me. Come on. Uh, yeah, you too. Let's go. All right, this is the last tour that we're doing of an unfinished Senpai HQ because before we board everything up and finish everything, I got a couple secrets I wanna show you. For the past like year and a half that we've been building this place, the goal is to make this the perfect content studio for filming, for streaming, for making music, for stream beats. And we are very, very close. Uh, I'm gonna show you a couple things. I wanna start with the recording studio because you haven't seen that yet. This is the beginnings of a world-class recording studio made specifically for us that all the premium music at Streambeats is gonna be produced at. Let me show you. So this entire recording studio was built underneath my garage. When we built the home, we dug out underneath it specifically to build a recording studio because it's entirely encased in cement. It's like the perfect room for this. But we went, we went one step further. I wanna show you something in the walls before they, before they cover it all up. I'm gonna have, Scott's gonna show you. So on every single one of these walls, between the physical wall and the drywall, there are these clamps called ISO clamps that are like rubber clamps that hold onto the framing that the drywall is mounted to. So there is zero vibration coming from the outside into here. It's, it's completely, perfectly soundproof. Once you're in here, can I say no one will hear you scream? Is that weird? That's a little weird. It's true though. Yeah, no, no one's gonna hear it. <laughs> I didn't know where to go with that. <laughs> but we also did one more thing in here that the designer had never done before. He's built recording studios like this. He's never built one made for streaming. And I added a couple extra things in here. Check this out. So check out those cables coming out of the wall. There's that one there that Scott's showing you. And then there's this one here inside the vocal booth. This is where people are gonna be singing. Got all these cables coming out right here. Those are usually just audio cables. So if you wanna put on headphones or record vocals out here on the couch, you can do that. But we added one extra thing to both of those, which is an HDMI cable. Both HDMI cable in here and in the vocal booth and even a couple more inside the walls because we wanna be able to live stream a lot of the process here. Or when we have maybe a super cool streamer come and work on a, a single with us, we want them to be able to stream. So we're gonna have cameras mounted and cameras placed all around the studio to be able to live stream the music process. It's gonna be really cool. Look, <laughs> if you remember the old videos on the channel, if you've been here a while, which by the way, I'm using this because the AC is on down here. It's gonna sound terrible. We're gonna see how this sounds. But if you've been here a while, you've been a part of the Alpha Gaming community for months, years, whatever, you remember when every single video was shot in the exact same spot, from the same angle, me sitting in the same place with my stream set up behind me. You guys remember that? Which is great if you're just trying to get used to making YouTube videos and you need that portion to be convenient. You're trying to get stuff out consistently and you're learning other processes, but once you want to be creative with what your video looks like, it's very limiting to only be able to have one camera angle and that's all I could really do. So, is it getting brighter in here? Oh, I think the sun just came out. <laughs> I was like, that's weird, it's someone down here. So anyway, when I started setting up my perfect YouTube studio, the entire goal behind it was that every single space here was a film set. If you're in the dedicated film area, which is where I'm sitting right now, we've got this wall of TVs, which is really cool. We've got this stone wall behind you. We've got this gray wall for color correction, or you can do what I'm doing and shoot down the entire way and see that whole set behind me, which is gonna look really cool. Or I can shoot from the gaming setup. It's gonna look clean and nice. Or I can shoot from the couch in the chill area where the gaming, the, you know, the couch gaming, controller gaming stuff is. The point was to be able to give different videos or different sections of videos, different features feels, good variety to what we're shooting, while at the same time, very much feeling like Senpai HQ. And I think, I mean, I might be getting ahead of myself here. This could just turn out terrible. But I think we did a really good job. And I'm really excited for what this is gonna look like. I wanna show you one more thing that we did that ended up being nuts, because I kinda decided to do it 
halfway through the building of this place and kind of on a whim. So we'll see if it works. Come on, check this out. All right, when building this stream room, of course I wanted it to be a good creative space that was top priority, but after that, I'm terrible at cable management. We're all terrible at cable management. You're bad at cable management. So we did something kind of weird. Let me just show you. So this is my stream room and you'll probably notice there are an ungodly amount of holes in these walls. Because if I've learned anything, streamer setups evolve and as you change things, you don't redo cable management. I wanted every single wire to be able to go from any point of the room to any other point of the room through the wall. So we put an insane amount of tubes in here. In fact, let me just show you. If I pull out a flashlight, see there's one which goes there maybe? Maybe, a, I don't actually know where these go. Hold on, I should have taken a picture of this before they put the wall over it. <laughs> I'm just now realizing that. Uh, anyway, I'll figure out where every tube goes. Like look, look there's one all the way up here. Cause I'm putting a camera on the wall up here. It's like standing height. It goes to one of these. And one of these goes to here. And one of them goes to up here. One of them goes to outside. How many holes do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. We have 11 holes in the wall with tubes and I don't know where any of them go. When I figure it out, it's gonna be really great. You just wait. <laughs> Turn that off. Like guys, at the end of the day, we've been making videos on this channel for a while. I love what we've done. I wanna do more. I hope that you guys learn to enjoy these videos as much as we enjoy making them because I mean, that's the whole reason we're building this place. So look forward to it with us. We should be moved here making videos in here before the end of November. Fingers crossed. I'll see you guys then. Peace. I'm not going anywhere. It's, it's, it's a dramatic walk away. How'd it look? It looked good. All right.